A coin toss isn't actually 50-50, and I'm going to explain to you what the odds actually are, and how you can slightly tip it in your favor. But first I want you to think about a number between 1 and 100, because it's going to help me make a point later on in this video. There's a research paper by these mathematicians from Stanford, and in it they explain that flipping a coin isn't actually a question of randomness, but a question of physics. They've actually built a machine that can flip a coin and get the result that it wants, and that enough is enough proof for me that a coin toss isn't actually 50-50. Because if it was truly random, then machines wouldn't have been able to figure out the process. This means that they have figured out a way to control their environments, so that they always get the outcome that they want. The math behind it is actually quite sophisticated, with trigonometry, integrals, probabilities, all in three dimensions. But what are the odds of actually flipping a coin, it's 51%, 49% in favor of the side you are starting on, the side that is facing up. There are always people on my videos saying this is semantics, it's pedantic. For those people, I'm going to show you that 1% isn't as small as you might think. So do you have that number between 1 and 100? If it's 37, I want you to leave a comment on this video. That is the power of 1%. Check out my channel, I post random interesting videos, I guess.